Hi, welcome to Josie's Fun Kitchen. Take a look at what I am making today. Chicken masala. Marsala. Masala. But wait till you see the outcome. It is delicious. So please subscribe. Turn your notifications on so that you know when I'm uploading a new video. Thanks again. While I'm going along, I'm trying to do my videos a little differently. Uh, today I am going to just tell you the ingredients as I'm going along. But the first thing that we're going to do is heat up this pan. I'm putting it kind of on medium low. I'm going to start off with a quarter cup. We need more. Another quarter cup. So it's a half a cup of olive oil. In the meantime, while that's heating up, I'm going to pound out, we're gonna have a pound, right here it's about a pound and a quarter, you can do a pound and a half if you want, of chicken tenders. So we're gonna pound this out so that they're all nice and even. And I'm using this Pampered Chef pounder, mallet, which I'm not even, I know sometimes I use a pan, but today I'm using this and I don't even have to give it much force and it's gonna be nice and flat. Okay, so that's done. I'm going to use my salt and pepper. Again, remember kosher salts. Get this on this side of the chicken. And then I'm gonna put about a teaspoon in there. Pepper on this side. Today, I'm gonna put the angle of this camera a little differently today. Once I start putting everything in here, I'm gonna move everyone over here to see, hopefully it works. If not, then we're just gonna, oops, a little bit of pepper into the one cup of flour that I'm using. I'm gonna leave this open because I'm gonna be seasoning. What I'm also gonna do is I took one clove of garlic. Yes, I said one clove. One clove, I cut it in half, and I'm going to put that into the pan. Two tablespoons of butter. Just cut it, you can see it on the butter where you have to cut it. I'm gonna make sure I'm doing it right here. And put that in there and that's gonna flavor up this dish. I'm gonna use about another two tablespoons in a little bit. So I'm gonna put that off to the side here because I'm gonna make a little paste and I'll show everyone. Try to figure out where to put this. Here we go. All right, so now we're going to take the chicken breast. Let me get another tong out here. I'm gonna mix this up. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to place a few of them in here. This is another quick meal. All right, here we go. We're going to start frying this up. Few, maybe two, three minutes on each side just until it's golden brown. Okay. Alrighty, I hope you can see what's going on now. Also, I'm gonna just salt and pepper this a little bit up here. And a little bit of salt. Here we go. In the meantime, I'm gonna chop up the celery. Nuts. <laughs> I'm always doing that. The parsley. All right, it's called prep. Okay, let's see how this is looking. Oh yes. Oh yes. Looks pretty. I've always said that food needs to look pretty because you're looking with your eyes. Oh, this looks really nice. Put this lid on here. All right, here are my mushrooms, and those are going to go in next. 
Now, what I'm doing is really cooking up these chicken breasts, and then we're gonna put them, take them out, and then finish the rest of the dish, and then we're done. I've already made some noodles on the side, and I'm, <laughs> this is actually really cool. I got this from Pampered Chef, and it's an insulated bowl. So I made the dish, and I'm gonna put this chicken on top of here. So I've made that ahead of time, and that's sitting there nice and warm, ready for this. Okay, looks good. Now I'm gonna take this, put it on the plate. Place that there. Get the garlic out of here. And chuck that. This is ready to go. And you're gonna put now the pound of whoops mushrooms and the mushrooms will shrink a lot and I'm eyeballing this you can see that they're nice and soft okay add the young the shallots mm. I'm gonna throw in the parsley now Okay, let's put in this garlic. <laughs> Soften this up a little bit. This looks really good. Okay, so a lot of the liquid is gone. Okay, the next thing we're doing is adding marsala. I'm gonna let that reduce. See how that reduced? It's kind of nice and creamy here. All right, now we're gonna have chicken stock. Okay, this is warm. I'm gonna put the flour, mix the flour with the butter because it's a thickening agent. But to make it easier to mash, add a little bit of, of the stock in here to help melt the butter a little bit. There you go, look at that. Can you see this? And that is it. Voila. Put the chicken back in here. And this is where it's gonna heat back up. Let's plate up. Okay, here we go, taste test. Let's see. Oh, chicken is nice and tender. Let me get a little bit of noodles. Mmm. 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 That's the same sound every time. This is yummy. This is really good. I like the noodles with that. You can make nookily with this, egg noodles, any spaghetti, or nothing. But, very good, you can taste the flavor of the mushrooms in here. And I like having as much parsley as I did, as I put in there. But this is delicious. So, before you leave, please subscribe, and turn your notifications on, share with your friends. But thank you very much for coming, and I hope you join me next time on Josie's, ah, ah, can't talk. Come back again and watch Josie's Fun Kitchen.